Getting started with keyboard shortcuts can feel a bit overwhelming, but let me tell you, it's one of the best things you can do to save time and get more done every day. I've been using shortcuts for over 15 years from my early university days to my consulting career and they've completely transformed how I work. My mouse is practically collecting dust. And after teaching millions here on YouTube, I can say with confidence, shortcuts aren't just fancy tricks. They're super powerful and easier than you might think. So if you're ready to start using shortcuts but aren't sure where to begin, you're in the right place. Today, I'll walk you through the essential shortcuts step by step so you can start boosting your productivity right away. In fact, if there are three shortcuts I wish everyone knew by heart, it's these. Copying and pasting. It sounds basic, right? But think about how often you're transferring bits of text from an email to a document or rearranging files on your computer. It's something we do constantly and if you're not using shortcuts, it can feel like a never ending task. I'll admit, I never used the long way, but I've seen plenty of clients and colleagues at work struggling through it. Whether they are sharing their screen in a virtual meeting or working right next to me. Watching them right click, scroll through menus and hunt for the copy or paste options each time, I cringed every single time. Those extra seconds using the mouse might not seem like much, but trust me, they add up fast. Every click and menu scroll down slowly chips away at your workflow and even if you don't realize it. This is where keyboard shortcuts make a real difference. Just a couple of quick tips. Control C to copy, Control and V to paste and Control and X to cut if you want to move something completely. After just a day of using these, they start to feel like second nature. And the best part, these shortcuts work everywhere. Drafting reports in Word, organizing numbers in Google Sheets, even moving files around on your desktop. Let me show you how it's done. Imagine I want to move this sentence somewhere else in my document. I just highlight it, press Ctrl and C to copy, place my cursor where I want it and hit Ctrl and V to paste it right there. It's that fast. And if I want to move it entirely, I use Ctrl and X to cut and then Ctrl and V to drop it exactly where I need. No menus, no endless clicks, just straight to the point. Once you start using these shortcuts, you'll wonder how you ever worked with them. Now that you've got copy, paste and cut down, let's move to another combo that'll save you time and fix those small mistakes we all make. Let's be honest, we all slip up sometimes, whether it's deleting a line of text, accidentally changing a format or moving something that didn't need moving. And if you're anything like me, those moments can be frustrating and throw you off your flow. But there's the thing, too many people still reach for the mouse to fix it. And the worst part, the buttons you need to undo or redo aren't exactly within reach. They're usually at the top of the window, far from where you're actually working. So each time you make a mistake, you're dragging your mouse all the way up to find those buttons and that back and forth starts to add up, breaking your focus and slowing you down. I'll bet you'd rather spend that energy getting things done, right? And that's exactly where these shortcuts come in handy. This is where Control plus Z and Control plus Y come to the rescue. Control plus Z is your undo key. It instantly erases your last action, whether it's an accidental delete or a formatting error. And if you decide you actually want to change back, Control plus Y lets you redo it with just one tap. It's like having a quick rewind and replay button at your fingertips, keeping you in control without the need to dig through menus. So let me show you how I use it. Say I delete this sentence by mistake. Instead of reaching for my mouse and moving it to the undo button, for example, in the top left corner of a Word document, I hit Ctrl and C and just like that, it's back. No extra steps. And if I decide I actually liked that edit, I simply press Ctrl and Y to bring it back again. Undo and redo work in just about every app out there, from Word and Excel to design software. And once you get used to it, these shortcuts will become your go-to fix for all those quick mistakes. Now that you've mastered undo and redo, let's move on to shortcuts that'll keep your work safe. 
these next ones make saving your progress fast and seamless so you never have to worry about losing a single edit. We've all been there. You're fully immersed in a project, making edits, and then suddenly it hits you. You haven't saved in a while. Your heart skips a beat and as you think, what if something crashes? I know that feeling too well. I've spent more hours than I'd like to admit redoing work that disappeared in a crash simply because I forgot to save. That frustration is exactly what I want to help you avoid. Now, if you're working online with everything synced up, you might not need Control and S every few minutes, since most platforms autosave for you. But for everything else, Control plus S is the quickest way to secure your work in one tap, no need for a mouse. And even if you're online, Control plus Shift and S is still super helpful for creating backup versions or saving a copy in a different format, like a PDF. Let's see this in action. Imagine I'm working on a document, making some key changes. With Control and S, every edit is saved instantly, keeping my work secure. And if I need a second version or backup, Control Shift and S lets me quickly save it as a new file, whether I want it in a different folder format or as a safeguard. Once these shortcuts become part of your routine, you'll never worry about losing work again. Saving becomes effortless and automatic, freeing you to focus on what really matters. Now, if you found these practical but powerful tips helpful so far and want even more beyond the video, sign up for my newsletter via the link in the description and start making real lasting progress today. With saving down to a single tab, let's shift gears to shortcuts that help you style and format your work with ease. These next ones will make your documents look polished in no time. Time. I mean, formatting should be quick and seamless, but for many people it's a constant interruption. You might find yourself breaking focus to reach for the mouse, highlight text and click through menus just to make a few words bold or underlined. It might seem small, but each click adds up, slowing you down. And that's where formatting shortcuts make all the difference. Instead of hunting for icons, a few simple key combinations let you make text changes instantly so you can keep your attention on the work itself. Here's how they work. Control and B to bold, Control plus I to italicize, and Control plus U to underline. Just a couple of quick taps and your text stands out without any extra steps. Let's take a look. Imagine I have a sentence that needs emphasis. I highlight it, press Ctrl B and it's bolded instantly. If you need italics, Ctrl plus I does it immediately and for underlining Ctrl U works just as fast. Having finished formatting a document, let's move on to some navigation shortcuts that will help you sift through your documents or spreadsheets without losing momentum. Since navigating through long documents or spreadsheets can be a real time drain, especially if you're scrolling endlessly with your mouse or tapping the arrow keys one line at a time. Whether you're working on a report, reviewing data or searching for a specific section, all that extra scrolling adds up fast and breaking again your focus and slowing you down. And that's where navigation shortcuts come in. With a few simple key combinations, you can skip through words, paragraphs, and even entire tabs in seconds, making it easy to get where you need to be without ever touching the mouse. Here's how they work. Control and arrow keys lets you move quickly through text, one word or paragraph at a time, depending on your program. Imagine working on a large report. Press Ctrl and right arrow. Move the cursor one word at a time so you can scan through content or make small edits faster without skipping entire sentences. If you need to jump whole sections, just use Ctrl and arrow down and move to the start of the next paragraph or heading. It's perfect for quickly reviewing a draft or skimming through information. In larger files, like long documents or spreadsheets, page up and down let you scroll by full pages instantly. No need to scroll line by line. And if you're in a spreadsheet with multiple tabs or if you have several tabs open in your browser, control and page up and control and page down let you jump to the next or previous sheet or tab in just a second. For example, say I have multiple sheets open for different data sets in Excel. If I want to move from January to February, all I need is Control and Page Down to jump to the next tab instantly. 
If you go back to January, control and page up takes me right back. Same in your browser. Instead of reaching to your mouse to switch tabs, just use control and page up or down. Sometimes when navigating through your documents, you might end up seeing some words or sentences that you would like to bold, copy or move. And surprise, surprise, there's a far better way than using your mouse for that. With control and shift and arrow keys, you can highlight text precisely and efficiently, all without ever lifting your hands from the keyboard. This shortcut lets you select exactly what you need faster than clicking and dragging. So here's how it works. Control plus shift plus right arrow highlights one word at a time to the right with control, shift and left arrow highlights one word at a time to the left. Perfect for when you want to quickly grab text for editing. Need to highlight larger sections? Control, shift and down arrow highlights entire lines or paragraphs downward and control and shift and up arrow highlights upward depending on your program. Imagine I want to select a few words in a paragraph. I place my cursor at the start, press Ctrl, Shift and right arrow to highlight each word quickly. And if I need to adjust, Ctrl, Shift and left arrow takes me back one word at a time. And this shortcut isn't just for text. In spreadsheets, Ctrl, Shift and arrow keys allow you to highlight date ranges in seconds. For example, in Excel, Ctrl, Shift and right arrow selects cells across a row, while Ctrl, Shift and down arrow highlights vertically down a column, making it easy to grab large blocks of data. Let's finish strong with a couple of shortcuts that make creating and sending things faster and easier. Perfect for when you need to stay in the flow and keep up with tasks. Whether it's drafting a new document, opening a new email or sending off a message. Using shortcuts can cut down all those little clicks and menu searches. These final shortcuts help you start new tasks and complete them without any unnecessary steps. Control and N instantly creates a new document, file or email depending on the program you're in. Need to draft a quick email? Control and N opens a new message in your email program without reaching for the mouse. Starting a fresh document in Word or Google Docs, Ctrl and N gets you there immediately, saving those extra clicks. And when it's time to send or complete an action, Ctrl and Enter has you covered. In programs like email or messaging apps, pressing Ctrl and Enter sends your message or completes the tasks right away. No need to click around to find the send button, just one quick shortcut and it's done. For example, in your email inbox, if you're ready to draft an email, simply press Ctrl and N to open a new message window. Type your content and when you're done, Ctrl and Enter sends it off instantly. I've shared some of the most fundamental shortcuts that everyone needs to know, but there are even more powerful ones that often go unnoticed. So watch this video next where I'll show you 12 amazing keyboard shortcuts you might not know yet and how they can make your work even smoother and faster than ever.